Good morning everybody, today is Monday the 2nd of October 2017 and it's Vlogtober day 2 and on on it October <laughs> so I didn't mention I am going to do it by the way if you notice my video from yesterday was titled that as well so yeah so this is food diary again today so I have got a whole meal roll this is the Sainsbury's bakery one I think it's about 54 grams which I'm counting as my healthy extra B and then I've also got two Daryl squares these are the light I think you will have three of them I believe or two I'm not entirely sure but whatever it is that will probably be the only two I'm having today so I've got that then for my lunch I have got some speedy bolognese which has got carrot onion celery chopped tomatoes and passaterine and it's got the 5% minced beef so I have got that and then I've also got the leftover butternut squash that I had from last night which I'm going to have with it too because obviously I can't make it into like a thin and I haven't got an oven at work so that's what I'm having and then I've got a packet of the Walker's Sensation Poppadoms in lime and coriander chutney Everyone's raving about these at the moment, so I thought I'd try them. And they are three sins. If I show you, it's a 13 gram bag and it's 63 calories. I've also got two apples for speed. I've got two easy peelers, which are speed. I have a Kit Kat mocha for five scenes and a timeout wafer for five and a half, and my usual bottle of water. So I shall see you all in a little while. I hope you're having a fantastic day and happy Monday everybody. Bye. Hey everyone. So I thought I would just come on and have a little chat with you. So I am back home from work and it's reasonably late and I've just got my dinner cooking. It's always late when I eat because it's by the time we finish work I just, it's late. Anyway, um, I thought I'd just come on and just tell you a little bit about my day. It's not been particularly good. Uh, well, food-wise, the rest of it was fine. So, as you saw, like, my food that I took in, I literally ate all of that. And I was just so hungry today that I just reached for anything that I could, literally. It was really not very good. Um fringes all over the place so yeah I've I had my lunch and I was still hungry and I had my time out bar and I was still hungry <laughs> and then I ended up having sort of towards the kind of later part of the day I had my friend hadn't eaten her a baked piece things like the you show I think they're called or something they're basically the baked um the baked uh, pea snap things which i don't really even like but it was better than nothing i could have had that or the whole grain um kettle bites which i think are four and a half so i thought if i went with the other ones they're four and you get a little bit more of them so i had that not to mention i had three shortbread biscuits and then i had a whole load of peanuts which i have no idea how much of that I had it was a bit of a disaster so yeah so I feel a bit bad about it because usually I'm okay and I don't have a problem I don't normally have this issue of not all the time sometimes I do and I'm able to control it and sometimes it's not that bad but today I think was one of the worst days in a while and <laughs> um, <clears throat> but the reason being, I think I know what the reason is. So basically, let me try and move you down because it's, there we go. Yeah, so as you all know, I don't get to work that early. It's usually quite late. Um, but today we were going to pick up my father-in-law from the airport. So as you all know, he's coming from Australia. <laughs> and he's staying on and off with us for three weeks so i'm really excited and we went to pick him up this morning i didn't say anything because i wasn't sure how things were going to plan out and 
we ended up leaving very early in the morning. I think we left about six-ish. It might have even been a bit before. It was about 6.30 actually, I think. No, it was 6.30 because it was not a long distance where we were picking him up, but there's a lot of traffic. So we wanted to make sure that we weren't late and that we had enough time. And the flight looked like it was coming in early, which it did come in early. So, um, yeah, so I didn't have so much food with me that I would usually have because I knew I was quite aware of that we had this journey and then we had a journey to go on to work. And I was sort of thinking that it was, it might get a bit warm in the car. I don't know what I was thinking. I should have just taken what I needed to take. But instead I didn't and I didn't have enough snacks. So I think that was the main thing. I think my dinner probably wasn't big enough. It was too small. They probably could have done with another portion of, of veg with it. And I think the actual reason why I ended up eating what I was eating was because I was tired. Now, a lot of the time I am tired, but I'd only had four hours sleep, which is probably why I was really tired. <laughs> and I was just eating. But the thing was, I actually felt hungry. It wasn't until later on in the day, I suddenly thought, now I feel like I'm eating for the sake of staying awake more than the sake of being hungry. So I feel that was kind of what happened. So I'm gonna have to kind of be a little bit more careful. I have worked out my scenes and um, I've had all my scenes for today and basically all of scenes for tomorrow. Um, I think I'm minus 0.5 scenes, so I'm still on plan. I'm not happy about it, but there's not a huge amount I can do. I can either turn around and think, well, today is, you know, I've only got tomorrow. I've done what I've done today, I've got tomorrow and I can either have my full allowance of scenes tomorrow and just wipe the slate clean or I could not have any scenes tomorrow but I kind of know what's going to happen if I don't have any scenes tomorrow. I'm going to struggle I think, I think I'm going to struggle. <clears throat> so I'm kind of thinking that I'm just going to have the scenes and what will be will be. I don't think... I'm not particularly worried about getting weighed. I'm not worried about what the scales are going to say. You know, whatever it is, is what I'll deserve. Um, I mean, none of it is hugely bad. I don't feel I've done particularly awful this week. It's the same as any other week, really. So I have nothing to worry about. I don't think I do anyway. <laughs> Who knows? Um, I, as you all know as well, I've had other weeks that have been a lot worse and I've been off plan for a whole day and it's not affected my weight loss so we shall see I'm not going to worry about it so I just thought I'd update you really I did want to have a little chat with you all but I just didn't feel like it the weekend and I don't know I just I just didn't feel like being on camera so I but I needed to have a chat with you all. and also I am doing I'm sure that you've seen it everywhere everyone's talking about it um on plan october so yeah i am trying my best to do it i mean usually it won't be a problem but today was just a bit of a hiccup and you know it doesn't matter if any of you go off plan while you're trying to do this you know don't worry about it just think well you know i had a blip and get straight back on it again which is what i'm doing so Please don't worry if you go off plan. It really, really, really doesn't matter. I just do the best you can. So yeah, I'm going to leave it there because I can hear that my burger in the halo is finished and I need to take you out there to have a look at it. So I'll see you in a couple of minutes. Hey everyone, so this is what I have for my dinner. So I have a Sainsbury's Skinny Beef Burger. This is the 3% fat or less. Um, burger so it's free I've then got the other half of my healthy extra a my second healthy extra a choice I didn't realize that you can have four dairy lights I probably did but this morning I hadn't realized so I've got another two of those on top I've then got some butterhead lettuce which is speed and two tomatoes which is speed as well and I cooked them in my halo this 
tomatoes and the burger so that's what I have for my dinner and I'm also going to have one of these Fanta things I think they're like fruit twists fruit twists they're zero sugar so I'm going to have one of those and then I'm going to have some fruit as well because I didn't take much fruit into work what I did but it was only a couple of bits so I'm going to have some strawberries which is speed and some melon which is speed and I thought I'd just show you all in one go so I can upload the video in a minute. I'm going to have two Hi-Fi light bars for my healthy op extra, healthy option. I can't speak. Healthy extra B, my second one. So I've got a chocolate mocha and a salted caramel. Yes, yeah, so that's what I probably I won't eat anything more than this. This is it and this is too much already I think considering how bad I've been today. But never mind, tomorrow is a new day and tomorrow is way day. So anyway, I shall catch you all early, bye and early tomorrow. Bye everybody. Oh, and I forgot to say that I've ended the day on like 30 scenes or something. <laughs> I'll just tell you how much I'm ending the day on because I completely forgot to tell you that. I got completely carried away. So I'm ending the day on 31 scenes and I'm minus 0 0.5, so never mind. Anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye.